Hi, I'm Lisa. And I'm Busty. And we're from Hot Brown Honey. Mm -hmm. um, I'm actually the director of Hot Brown Honey. And I'm the music director. And um, yeah, we're here in Dublin. We started in theatre way back. I think as First Nations uh, people, actually theatre and dance and music is just built into our bones. Mm -hmm. But seriously, I think, um, Busty, you said you played Jesus in a play I once. played Jesus. <laughs> It was a great play about Jesus, and that was my that's, role. That was the, that was the beginning of your your <laughs> launch into theatre. Yes. Uh, but then we did go on. We went on to make many works in in community, mm -hmm. um, and then also in in the professional realm, and been working together for the last twenty years um, yep. touring the globe. Yeah. Well, let's, well, how about HCL while yeah. we're here in Dublin? Yes. Hive City Legacy, the Dublin chapter. Mm -hmm. Tell us a bit mm -hmm. about it, Busty. Well, we're here to put uh, black and brown femmes of colour centre stage, challenge stereotypes, break boundaries, and paint a fresh new coat of stories onto the stage. Exactly. This is a moment where they get to shine, where they get to talk about their experience as, you know, black and brown, femmes of colour, living here in Dublin. Mm -hmm. And we we can't wait to, you know, help along with the journey. Mm -hmm. This is actually the sec second um, iteration of Hive City Legacy. We had the first one in London at the Roundhouse where we had 10 amazing performers, um, you know, and they ended up touring in 2019. So mm -hmm. excited to start again with mm -hmm. another group of incredible artists. Um, so make sure you get a ticket. Yes, and it'll be happening at Dublin Fringe Festival. Yes. Strangest thing. Well, mm. I think it's a bit more, well, what we discussed, we thought it's more like a premonition, which was sort of strange at the time. Yeah. You know, it was a bit of fun, wasn't it? Yeah, definitely was. We kind of, we decided to write a grant and imagine going to the South Bank Centre, to Queen Elizabeth's Hall and decolonising that stage. Exactly. Mm. And then little, you know, little did we know, about four years later, we did just that. We did it. 800 yes. screaming black and brown people <laughs> yeah. jumping up and down, yeah. decolonising that stage. So yeah. that was pretty fun. That was good. We yeah. didn't get the grant though. No, we didn't. No, Bummer. no. Mm. Never mind. But yep. <laughs> look out. Look out when you put something into the universe, what you yeah. say. Yeah. So Hot Brown Honey, we will be uh, going on to tour a Turtle Island, aka Canada, after the Hive City Legacy Project. Yeah, and mm. we'll be visiting all our First Nations peeps over there uh, in Vancouver and Ottawa. Um, so can't wait for that. Yeah. If you've got any friends over there, tell them to come along. Mm -hmm. mm. Mm. We're yes. not sure we have a micro one. No, though. we just have clear superpowers. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. And that would be just decolonizing one stage at a time. That's right. Yep. Radical Fierce Love, decolonizing, moisturize. moisturize. Yes. Check it out.